Throughout the whole conference, we've talked to a lot of people, a lot of like educators and adults and stuff, and like their whole lives are kind of dedicated to like students and the youth. So I think it, it was really interesting to see, you know, the different ways that they try to support the youth. Whether it's issues on mental health or it's about uh, academic related issues, is things that you know that comes from our personal mind that's developed from our personal mind, not just something that's like planted by adults and other people. So I can really tell that it's really our voices that matter the most to them. At the Boost Conference, we had the opportunity to connect with people, have conversations, do podcasts, do interviews, and we got to do a panel discussion with students where they got to ask them about stories and get the perspectives of young people and youth voices. We have a huge gap of youth voices and a huge gap of um, representation of the true leadership that is happening from youth. I think that there are a lot of young people who are leading stories and leading change and creating a lot of powerful things in the world that aren't necessarily yet getting the recognition for their work, um, but I see that changing soon. I think anytime young people are telling stories, we as a society are doing the right thing. We want to be hearing good stories from the people who have lived those particular lives. And for young people to be able to tell their stories, articulate where they're coming from, how they're feeling, what their hopes, what their dreams are, I think that's absolutely crucial. So it's great to be in a partnership with Mizzen because they provide organizations with an app that has all the tools you need to be connected with our curriculum, with tips, to be connected with a youth media producer like me. So those are some of the advantages that Student Reporting Labs has with this partnership with Mizzen. At its best, the Mizzen by Mott app also allows for young kids and for teens to also see how their own experiences inform their worldview and make them that much better at telling unique stories or exploring the world. I think adults have so much to learn from youth. We just have to make sure that we're creating the space for you to share because who better to learn from than you? After this conference, I feel like I've learned that they care more and they want to hear our voices more and they want to hear the kind of stories that PBS NewsHour can make on those topics. And I think it's something important that they're recognizing it and that they're able to see that it's a story that youth are interested in and want to speak and use their voice in order to have that be heard.